Right, so yeah, I hear you. Epic. Right, okay, guys, let's see what we think of this. I want your thoughts. Go. Yeah, that's it, we're not on view, that's okay. So this was announced the other day. It does look cool, doesn't it? But Here we are, EVP. Yeah, it pl plugs in via HDMI. Oh, Mega Man. Yeah, nice. it's got import slots. Uh, Dark Stalkers. Unfortunately, it's got Dark Stalkers one, which is probably one of the worst out of the out of the actual three. Third one, notorious to be in the rest. See, it's only sixteen. So Puzzle Fighter, Strider, Goals and Ghosts, nineteen forty-four. They could do so much more with it. Why? See, it's got what? This is it. Wi-Fi enabled. So, uh, look, are they going to do it? USB. Are they going to make it so you can? Games on itself. We'll rewind it a little bit. Right. We've shown you that back, didn't it? You see there's a port. There, right? Yeah, there's a port for USB. 25th of October. You'd probably have to, if there's a port for USB, you'd probably have to. Let me chip get it. this back. Well, not bit. chip it, but you know what I mean? You'd have to have it so it can't. Can't fit right. it, wouldn't you? Right, here we are. So, 1944. Alien vs Predator, Armored Warriors, Capcom Sports Club, Echo Fighters, Dark Stalkers, Cyberbots, Captain Commando, Final Fight, Pro Gear, Giga Wing, Mega Man. Mega Man's good. Yeah, Super Puzzle Fighter 2 Turbo, Strider, Street Fighter 2 is the hyper fighting one, which is really strange. Um, you think they'd have Turbo? Ghouls and Ghosts. Now, well, what I don't get on this, right, I okay, so. For it. Capcom Sports Club, I'm not sure on Eco Fighter, I'm not. Uh, there's Strider, definitely, and I'm sure Mega Man. One player games. You Strange. Got, you got two controls. I don't know. I don't, I don't Ghouls and Ghosts. Enough. One player game, surely. Uh, yeah, I don't think there's enough. There's enough on it for me to retrofire spending two hundred quid. Now, I know that that is. Are you, are you sure? Is, is there only going to be sixteen, or the more in take time? Is the more in No, that no, that's it. Sixteen uh, that's been talked about at this moment in time. Uh, and what's, com what's coming with re with the release? What's built into it? Now it's got USB. Let's see if we can get to the little. Uh, you can get. Is there an SD slot? Yeah, there's a little bit here where it shows you. Here we are. Yeah. Look. Yeah, I'm going a bit too far. Come on. It's not going to let us get on that bit. Here we are. Look. So it's got USB. HDMI. HDMI and obviously your power. So USB, if you people are going to mod the fuck out of this, USB straight into it. You, hard, you, a portable you hard put drive. Like, portable hard drive, anything. So basically, get every all your ROMs on it, and hopefully you should just be able to. Uh, See, if, if if they could do that, then it might be worth getting, because you could just have it. It'd be something fun one to have. Yeah. But for the sixteen games that are on it, I don't think it's worth it. It looks sick though, but fucking 16 games is a fucking nightmare. Um, hey, Michael, just, what do you uh, think, Michael? You'll be quiet about this. Uh, it's alright, but it's a lot of money. I think you're paying the designer, mate. That's yeah. it, yeah. You, you, absolutely, mate. You're playing, it looks sick. You're playing for but it. Even that bit there, the uh, like the back of it, the power in that looks really good. But yeah. I can't see. And I'm going to say, we're 160. Yeah. Well, uh, it, it, uh, America, uh, I think it's over two hundred dollars. Uh, well, let's see what I've also. I'd, pay I, if it I'd had have like a bit of them. Um, yeah, uh, if you can jailbreak it, it's worth it. What it's it, what's loaded up is shit. Yeah, how much? What be well? Be well. I think in America, uh, uh, just over two hundred dollars. That exactly. <laughs> they they can get they can get fucked for that. Exactly, mate. It's uh, It'd be worth it if it gets jailbreaked. Definitely. If someone fucking figures out how to fucking mod it, so you well you want I don't think you'd have to mod the system, you'd have to mod a hard drive. It's the software inside what, what yeah. plays it, because I'm presuming it's gonna run through some sort of like main final uh, uh what's it called? Is it final spin, something like that? Emulator. Uh, yeah. Um some sort of right? it's gonna use some sort of emulator inside where you can select the games. So obviously if you can add to it by USB, 
then happy days. Obviously, it's got Wi-Fi as well, so you could, you could be able to download them over internet straight to it. That would be in, in theory, which would be pretty cool. But as it stands at the minute, you've got nearly two hundred pounds for sixteen games. Yes, it looks cool and everything like that. The, but game, the games aren't good enough. For me. We could make that ourselves. I uh, don't know how much it's going to cost here in South America, in my country, but I say it's going to cost a shitload of money. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Fucking there. Fucking with li Wi-Fi. Left it out loud. I like the Snake's Mega Drive. Yeah, they could put... Re they could, anyone could make one of these and put, like, a retro pie in it so you could still play all your Mega Drive, snares, all that type of thing. Um, It'd be worth... I think... It's, I think... It's, I but the thing is, is it going to be limited edition? Is it going to be one of those things that you buy and in six months' time... It's yeah, like... Like, no, like there might be only so many of them made... You basically pay, you are paying just for the actual unit, aren't you? The um, unit looks fucking sick though. Yeah, yeah, like, we'll, we'll bang it off, yeah. I just wouldn't pay for it. I, just, I don't think the game's worth what the game's on. It needs about 60 It's not exactly something you could just stick on your knee, are you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It looks massive. It's not exactly something you could just stick on your knee either, is it? It looks massive. It's huge. It'd so, be good as well if you could plug it into like a PS4 or your PC and you could have your Tekken. Playing your two player on it. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, cool. yeah, yeah. If the stick could be used uh, for, for 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 other things, yeah, absolutely, yeah. Because it's got it it's got USB. Yeah, you so plug it in USB straight to your PC, straight to your game console. You could, have, you, you could have your two player on street whatever you've got. Then it's a sick, sick. Then it's a sick stick. But if it's just solely for the purpose of plugging into your TV, well, what with what you've got then? There's probably I'd I'd say it might be worth it over time. You might you might see what more come on to it. Yeah. It's not worth 160 quid with games on, but you can do it. Uh, no, yeah, the sandwich sticks, mate, yeah. They are sandwich sticks. It, I, 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 it looks nice. I read a little bit about it. Yeah. Sandwich sticks, sandwich bottles. The emulator is legit, question mark. Confusion over the of Final Burn Alpha emulator. What? So they're using Final Burn as the emulator? So what's that? Final Burn, I've got Final Burn on here. It's, it's just like main, but obviously it's not. No emulation is legal if you haven't got the rights for it. Uh, Final Burn was always like something like main what basically some guys put together and then you played your games on. So whether or not that's sixteen pre-installed games. Right. So yeah, I like how they're saying it's it's optimistic that they're saying sticks. So that pre-installed you know game. That right. Let's have a look. So, so tell you what sticks they are in that there. Well, that's on Nintendo. Uh, website so we've got featuring a pair of competition class sandwich jfl tp 8yt sticks with the eight-way gty directional gates uh, obsf eight, buttons for the finest precision uh, 16 pre-installed games from the original capcom cps1 and cps2 arcade roms with emulation provided by final burn alpha wow so they're actually using a product what as far as I were aware, Final Burn were just created by just like people like us. Could be like April Fool's coming out. The, yeah, unfortunately. Middle of May. Oh, oh, middle of <laughs> May. <laughs> <laughs> Delivering an authentic and accurate arcade experience exclusively for the Capcom Home Arcade. Breakthrough high scores. Uh, so it records all your high scores mm -hmm. in single player. Apparently, I, on one of the videos I watched, that's what the Wi Fi is for. So you can it'll yeah, keep, keep it'll, popping, yeah, it'll update all this, shit. upgrading all the scores. Um, yeah, it says uh, home arcades on board Wi Fi to a worldwide high score leaderboard. Yeah, you know, still not worth £200 just to get your name up. Problem, there, problem, problem is, though, as well, if Here it's we connected are. to Wi Fi, then you might not be able to jailbreak it. Yeah. You'd have to turn that off, wouldn't you? Because they're going to know that it's got stuff on it they shouldn't have. Arcade fans will no doubt be over the moon to see these games re released and given the treatment they deserve. I don't really see what, what, what the treatment's going to be. Getting your name on a high book and scoreboard. The arcade stick. Uh, this is yes, hundred ninety nine pounds English so pounds. Quid then. So that's uh, in dollars. What about two fifty, two sixty, two hundred sixty dollars? Probably yeah. It's about one point four, one point five to a pound. Uh, of course, these cabinets cost you would cost you significantly more in money and living space. <clears throat> but that's only assuming the emulation is perfect. <laughs> Be really link deleted. Uh, keep a very close. It just says keep a very close eye. All coming out in October. 
We don't want to know when it's out. We want to know what, if we can fucking put other games on it. That's all everyone's going to be bothered about, whether you can actually... Or if you can use it on your PS4 to have two player on fucking Mortal Kombat from it. Yeah. Because then it would be pretty cool. Uh, yeah, in fact, let me just uh, just do go on to your uh, I'll go on your internet there. Just yeah. do uh, two hundred well one hundred ninety nine pound to dollars. Let's get an, let's get an accurate reading on this thing. Um, to, to, I've got rupees <laughs> to Bitcoin yeah. to dollar. Yeah, two hundred and sixty. Just well, two yeah, five eight. Two hundred fifty eight dollars. And forty nine cents is the equivalent of one hundred ninety nine English pounds. They'll probably round it up there, won't they? Because it's that's that's at the minute. That's 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 uh, swapping over, not. So they probably got a set price for it. Cause yeah. That's just swapping over at the minute. Yeah. Probably two fifty. Yeah. Maybe two fifty, two sixty. Yeah. Maybe. 